Hi everybody, welcome back. Um, I would just like to say um, thank you so much everybody for all your likes and subscribes and everything. I, I really do appreciate it and um, um, I'm just overwhelmed with uh, what response I've been getting from these little videos and things. I really enjoy making them. Um, um, it, they, I find them quite fun because I have to think about what I'm going to do from one week to the next. And, um, and I try to bring them out on a Sunday. Now, just... Just to let you know that I'm just doing an eight day course at the moment with uh, Louise Fletcher. Um, it's the it's the free uh, Find Your Joy course. Uh, I bet there's lots of you on here who's already doing it as well. So if I just do um, end up being a little bit late with the video, um, like next week, for instance, or something like that, it's just because I'm doing this course and it is only eight days. So hopefully I should be able to... To fit it in um, it was a little bit of a struggle today because it was day one of the course so I was having to do the course and uh, get out um, some um, work to you as well which I'd part done but I needed to edit the video and things so but this video is um it's about neuro art again and um, it's um, much more simpler this time uh, but still sticking with these circles but this time I'm putting something in it so um nice little surprise <laughs> no seriously um have a go yourself um and in the circle you know just doing a large circle I literally drew round a bowl and um and then I went in with my charcoal and things like that and um just to make it more 3d and then I put a simple picture in it i'm going for simplicity i can't see the point in make you can make things as as um beautiful and colorful as whatever that you want you know that's what it's all about is color and and everything as well but i'm keeping them quite basic and everything at the moment um just so that i can um you know give out a video to you to show you what what to do so um Without further ado, we'll uh, get on. <laughs> So this is the finished um, effect. Now, what I want to explain to you about it is, excuse me, is I've done the circle and I've, you know, it's it's a lovely nice circle and I've used the charcoal around the bottom of here and I use those circular motions to pull it all in to make it look nice and 3D. Um, but the, the thing that I wanted to explain about the neuro lines, instead of it all being encased inside it, this time I wanted to give the effect that it's, it's passing it by. So the neuro lines are passing it by so that, you know, this is almost like the world because inside it you can do whatever picture that you want. So here in the distance I've done a little tiny weeny church and a hillside at the side of it and the moon and a tree coming from the side and the little tiny path. And then the low horizon line. Try not to put horizon lines in the middle. Either put them at the top if you want more of the bottom of your picture to show or nearer the bottom if you want more of the top of your picture to show. And that's the same with all art. So, um, But um, I've done all the connections, but this time I concentrated on going through it, all the way through it, going all the way through it. Whereas before I was going round the back and underneath and upside down and everything. But this time I wanted to go all the way across. The only place that I didn't go over was that hillside, just to give it a little bit of a dif difference. And so the, it just meant that, you know, sometimes these feelings that they just pass by. Oh, can you hear Peckity's uh, started off for us? <laughs> Hi Peckity. And um, and that's what and that's what I I wanted to give the effect of this time. But make sure when you're doing all of your 
euro lines that the the pulling away making it look like it's pulling away from the from the circle you know actually join them onto your circle like it's pulling it so in this case it it's having to go it's trying to sucker on but it's not it's managed to pass by and that's how i see it today and that's how how i felt today i didn't want to be pulled in and i i, di I didn't want that at all i wanted it all just to pass by i've had a lovely day today and so therefore that's just how i felt and it was nice releases and passing and passing by so uh that's it so i hope that you like the video and uh Please like and subscribe and I'll um, see you again hopefully next Sunday. Oh, some people have been asking me about my brush. Yes, um, and my old brush has been painted. This is, well, it's a she actually and it's called, she's called Dotty. And she's, she's used for everything, for just sweeping away anything that's nearby, any bits and bobs and things like that. Um, although the brush is like really old, the, um, the bristles on it are really lovely and soft for that, so... Um, yeah, so that that's Dotty. Um, so um, yeah, so um, so I hope you like the video. Like I say, please like and subscribe. And um, um, we're trying. I'm trying my best to aim to get um a thousand subscribers before Christmas. That would be lovely. And uh, we're building up a really nice community now. And I'm loving it when you all comment and things. And uh, if there's something special that you'd like me to do, then don't don't hesitate to ask. Um, so uh, here we are. Just the last few pictures. But different angles. So um, hope you enjoy. Bye.